I almost forgot, almost forgot, well, how could I? All right, so formatting your, your, your word, your paragraphs and your chapters, etc., etc., really important themes. Um, why on earth it didn't um, dawn on me to, to mention something about it? One, because, as you notice, I haven't put any numbers, I haven't numbered any of my chapters or, or, or anything, which is, well, bad form, really, but, hey, you know, I don't see them around in many ebooks, and it's an unnecessary but work, um, unnecessary work. But if you really wanted to make an impression, well, then fine. There's nothing to stop me, for example, putting um, putting a number in in front of, um, for example, my introduction here. I can put number one, um, probably put a dot there. I, I could number them, and then consequently go run down the pages and um, place a number. Of, place a number uh, you know uh, uh, dear me dearie me come on uh, place numbers there okay now the other thing I'd like to mention is that uh, sub your subheadings now subheadings and also your kind of um, paragraph spacings um, now the reason you'll notice why most of the paragraphs that you'll ever see in most theme books are all broken up um, it, the reason is, is because people don't like to read long length paragraphs they get tired bored easily and they lose interest well you know it's not my fault that there's lazy people out there who just don't like reading at all it's a shame really because it defeats the object of uh, reading a good book full stop but nonetheless if you tend to keep your paragraphs four lines long um, possibly five lines long I mean you really are pushing it going beyond five lines which I do in places but that's fine I try and break them up where I can okay I mean where you've got an image there obviously it's gonna it's gonna look a lot longer but but not necessarily it's all it's it's all kind of in the mind if you know what I mean people I like to feel like oh I'm, am I gonna get through this book while I'm reading you know it's something there's something about us humans that works that way so you know, for argument's sake, let's play the game, let's play it by the rule. So try and keep it, you know, within, you know, maximum really five lines long and, and break them up. And, and and also there are there is a rule about where you break a paragraph up to run into the next page. Okay? So so bear that in mind. Um, also yeah. I'm coming back to my earlier point now there is one place where I have put little subheadings along through the entire theme and that the reason is is because it's longer than one page worth of, of writing and, and, and it is this chapter in fact this chapter of what can I do with an ebook and what can it do for me you know so basically and the reason why you would put you know like outsourcing um, what can an ebook do for me you know you, the reason why you do that is if someone's reading through they get distracted and they come back if they've got a, if they've got pages loads of uh, all these four and five paragraphs long long sorry these five lined or four lined paragraphs everywhere they're not going to be able to distinguish where they left off so it does help with in this case I have put long you know I have put um, little subheadings there and I've highlighted them up I bolded them up sorry you know it, because it does help in that respect so bear those things those things in mind okay so I have gone over this one a bit but but hey you know I compensate by making a short one after it <laughs> but, these things are really important now of course the other thing the other thing which is which is is the fact that you know I mean really I have got these I haven't done the spacings here so if you're up in the in on the home page if you look at the top um, left hand menu there where my um, mousy pointer is the big yellow <laughs> dot as if you could miss it I mean the home but but if you come here to this this tab here line spacing now I've got mine oh I don't seem to have my line space at all but but really you know if you're writing ebooks and this is like inter mar uh, internet marketing ebooks if you like but it, you know if you're doing something like I think officially you want to be doing them at uh, you know 1.5 so this is the tab that you come into line spacing and you choose you know that's one and a half you know line gaps okay so bear that in mind you know it's 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 what aesthetically uh, aesthetically looks good for you what you feel comfortable with I mean obviously if I was to 
1.5 the entire ebook here it's going to be double as big <laughs> okay and i don't want people to get bored and tired oh there's too much value in this ebook i can't read all this it must be thrown away you know so i'm trying to please everything but at the same time i must point out those few points now coming back to the point where i was showing you you know an idea for example you know where to get the contents for your ebook i.e. you know i drummed up a load of articles pl articles and stuffed them in there there isn't a word there isn't a paragraph in here that's or a sentence or, or, or that, that's anything to do with copy pasting i copy pasted it into the document to show you how easy it would be to you know get the mind flowing the juices flowing um, and all that carry on but um, what I didn't show you is supposing that you're dragging content from the internet right and this was uh, and this was your document and you've copied and slapped it in here uh, and then you know you don't you can't be bothered to do do everything well fine that's fine you know I don't mind I just don't like plagiarism this all <laughs> but anyway so you look down here and you think well I'm going to try and 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 supposing where my mouse is here you want to close this gap up here and you find mm, hold it a minute no I, I just want it to go up one line and it's going directly out well that means it's because the spacing has gone a bit wrong so what you do in this instance is you'd highlight all the way down you know where these gaps are to allow you to do that and watching the mousey and if you go to page layout you'll notice here that you know these four here the spacings here the indents and spacing really they should be um, 0 cm but this one here for example is shown 18.9 so if you were to tap that bottom bottom drop down thing until it reaches the zero then you'll find all things considered done and dusted and then you've got the control of it yeah so I needed to point those few things out because they are important if you wanted to improve your work fine great great stuff um, and likewise here you know okay well, why would you want to do that because again you know I wanted I just wanted a gap there but it's not letting me you know it's more than one oh okay well sometimes it works that way and as I say you know you come up here go into page layout um, check out this little indent and spacing part here and any of the if any of these are more than like zero point and you want to just start from scratch so you can decide what on earth you know you're doing with that then fine you know then you've got the then you've got control as to you know how you're going about setting your ebook up well I hope that um, helps I'm just going to check it do with um, awkward space has done that same reason why yeah yeah and, and um, the last thing of course which is the reason why also is that I've applied you know return to a table of contents in the bottom of those in most of these pages here also is because there's nothing worse than you like two miles down <laughs> two miles exaggeration of the Sun if you'd like you know so long into your thing and you oh I've got to scroll all the way back because I want to see another <laughs> you know once again help those lazy critters out <laughs> sit up a little uh, you know that's why I do that really okay but your design is unique to you you do as you will as you want but I'm just pointing out those few things okay all right well um, I hope you got anything out of this video series and the ebook of course of uh, Given you my email address, whatever. If you want to make um, any comments about it, that's fine. Um, and I bid you farewell. And I hope you enjoy life and succeed very well in all that you do. Toodle pit now. Bye.